know where they are now? What are you, Scarlet? Uh, what am I scared of? I don't know, what do you mean I'm scared of? Losing control. You think I'm scared of losing control? Yeah. In what way? I think that, um... <laughs> you're the type of person who... would say... Um, Fuck. My biggest fear is tornado, but deep down, the biggest fear you have is not feeling in control of your life and surrounding. I think that a lot of people choose these kind of thing because it is easy. Uh -huh. But the real fear that they have is oh. more. It, it isn't. Is tangible as is. It is things that happen in your life that make you uncomfortable. And I think for you, you're talking about real life. Kind of talking about Tommy T. Who would be most uncomfortable in a situation which you failed out of control of. And what makes you think that? Because you really got into a big, deep dive there. I'm curious to know what makes you feel that way. Not you seem so. pretty confident. I think uh, you're a very confident person. You um, are confident in your ability to talk. It means that you have had a lot of practice in this and you feel confident that you will be in control of the conversation and that you sometimes, because you're able to talk people into corner and admit this kind of thing, this gives you a sense of power sometimes. And uh, because it is something that you're comfortable doing, or used to it, uh, I think that is evidence you like to be in control. Mm. I could be wrong. Yeah, you could be massively off. Am I? Uh, no, I don't think so. I think it's, it, it, it feels somewhat accurate to an extent. Yeah, you seem like someone who is not out of control often. Is that a good thing or a bad thing, though? Sure, you don't want to be out mm. of control, right? What about it's not a fear of not having control, it's just a case of you just take control. It's not out of fear of not having control. It's more so uh, I prefer having the control over others having the control. Not out of fear, but out of choice. I think the more that you do something, the more comfortable you get. And a lot of people don't like to be uncomfortable. And besides, taking control takes a lot of effort, right? Being leader, telling people what to do. It is something that you choose to do, right? And there's a reason you choose that. Normally, you know, it isn't overt fear, but rather what you naturally tend to enjoy. You enjoy to be in that position or be in control, and therefore, you know, uh, if you do it often enough, when you are not in that way, all of a sudden this is something new for you that you haven't experienced in a while. So what about if you learn it, you're actually... Uh, you enjoy, but you're comfortable feeling uncomfortable. Hmm. What if you realize and you discover that being uncomfortable is actually the key to a lot of things? Uh, if that's pushing boundaries, that's uh, out of comfort zone. Oh, I mean, I, I do agree with this. I think that being uncomfortable a lot of times is where you grow. Mm -hmm. um, but that doesn't mean it isn't scary, right? Is it maybe it's not fear, maybe it's anything else? Maybe. Maybe. I just uh, usually find that um, the more powerful a person is, the more uncomfortable they can get. When they uh, are suddenly without power. Uncomfortable in what way, though? As in, like, they feel uncomfortable, or you mean 
that they have the capacity to be more uncomfortable. What is the difference between those two? Uh, first one being that like they instantly just become uncomfortable when they haven't got power. Second one being that they uh, can survive in those environments longer or stronger or better. They can survive in environment where they're uncomfortable. Kind of like they can survive well, in an environment there. where they're uncomfortable or they're not used to because they're powerful. Hmm. No, I'd say the opposite. It's normally um, a powerful person gets that way because they um, so used have to the power. Power tend to attract power. <coughs> oh my goodness! There is a the dog in the car. Up. Very loud. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Hold on one second, I'm just going to uh, check something on my phone.